joy, joy. Welcome to paradise. It's coming close to sunset. It's a beautiful night. Cool down from this morning. I've been walking for a few minutes and I found a, a, a feather, a bird feather, crow feather. And they say when you find a feather, it's the angels telling you you're having the good thoughts or they're blessing what you're thinking about. And I turn the corner and look at that, I found a second feather. This is the second feather I found tonight. Look how beautiful that is. Not even sure what kind of bird it's from, but look how beautiful Mother Nature. The inherent beauty, the art, the artist, the master artist. Hiya, Deb. Joy, joy, joy. Sat your courage. Thank you both for walking in paradise tonight. All right, I'll bring this feather with me just to show folks as they log in. Thanks for the love, guys. It's a beautiful, beautiful night. It's a little muggy, but it's cooled down quite a lot once that blazing sun and the humidity eased up. Suzanne, joy, joy, joy. Welcome to the walk. Look at this gift that Mother Nature brought to us today. It's the second feather on this walk. Thanks for joining us on this walk in paradise. It's been such a peaceful night. I was sitting outside in the shade having my evening tea. And I don't know, I didn't even notice the deer walking up. She got closer to me than ever. Signs of fairies, signs of loved ones who have crossed over. Feathers have all sorts of great, beautiful meanings. So I was sitting there looking at my iPhone and I just kind of, something tickled my leg and I just swiped like a fly. And that sudden move is what startled that mother deer. She was so close to me. It was so beautiful. And as she ran away, I was just in such a peaceful mood. And I could feel that she wasn't, that she was kind of peaceful too. She wasn't really afraid like in the past. Neither of us had that fear. I think it was more of a, a response, an old fight or flight triggered response. And I just keep praying that one of these days that Mama and I are going to just peacefully meet face to face, sniff her out, sniff me out, maybe, maybe, maybe pet her, I don't know, hold my hand out, let her smell me. That would be lovely. Let's see what's going on out here. Beautiful, beautiful walk. Look at the hills in the background. This side, we've got a more stuff, not as compelling a view as this. You can see the haze in the sky. It's from all, you can tell it's a muggy, it's been a muggy day. Well, just the first week of August. This is my favorite month of the year. I chill out and relax more. It was so hot after lunch. I went and sat outside in the shade and fell asleep. I cooled down so much I came back in and even the house seemed cooler. So I guess it was an internal thing for me. Do have the fan on today, the ceiling fan. Don't need to put it on too often, but when it's muggy out, that's when I put the fan on. Oh, I do have some good news. The My TV show, Talking With Our Angels, is going to start airing sometime this week. And as soon as I find out the times, I'll post it. I'll do a live. I'll post it on the Talking With Our Angels page. Rush hour, here comes a little more rush hour. Look at those colors of the sunset. Look how beautiful that is. Look at that, look at that. Ah, there's a heavenly sight. Look at that, we have 
heaven on earth. We also have a poor internet connection for some reason. Never had that over here. Well, I guess we have to keep moving. Hopefully you guys are seeing this. It says recording. There we go. Look at that. Let's get some angelic. There we go. There's an angelic sight. Ah, let there be light. Let there be light. Joy, joy, joy. Hermio. Hermio. Welcome to a walk in paradise. Look at that beautiful, beautiful light shining through the trees, the apple trees. And you can even see Mother Nature. She's already growing apples months in advance. It's a metaphor for life. We're always given things way before we even need them, before we even ask for them. We just have to look around. Look at that angel light. The light of life, the light of love, the light of joy, the light of peace. Cheers, Hermio. Where do you live, sir? What state, what country? This is live from upstate New York. I know a lot of people think New York City when they hear New York. Well, this is proof that there's much more to New York than... <laughs> That city life. And I was blessed with two, finding two feathers tonight. I'm holding on to the second one because it's more rare. It's a beautiful design. You could hear the piece, you could hear the peepers. Chirp, chirp, chirp. I was sitting by the evergreen tree the spruce tree and right around sunset for some reason the trees seem to give off more oh there's a deer up there did you see it i don't think so one of the deer just kind of ran through i feel like i'm sounding like that guy from the pbs painting show bob somebody i think that was his name bob oh i'm talking like that and I think a little tree wants to be over here. <laughs> so, you could probably find him on YouTube. I'm pretty sure you can. If you don't know what I'm talking about. And if you remember that show. That was a really nice show. It's very meditative. Here we go. Here's some more paradise pictures. Look at that picture. Living in paradise. There we go. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Dog's not happy. Hey, he's barking at me. Meow. Hello. What? Meow. <laughs> okay. Now I know what you're barking at. Now you know what he's barking at. I'm taking. I'm doing a live Facebook. You want to say hello? I'm sorry. I say I'm doing a Facebook live. Oh no, that's okay. <laughs> hey. It's a gorgeous night. Oh, God. Yeah, but the rain's coming again. Yeah. Well, we had a couple of sunny days. Look at this beautiful feather I found. Oh, wow. Turkey? Maybe it's a baby turkey. Yeah, it probably is a turkey there, feather. There's a couple of flocks around here. Okay. They might, I think they had two, uh, two broods this time. They had a large group of, of babies. Yeah, there were some big ones, and then there's another brood that's smaller. So they must have had two sets. Could have been. Yeah. Good to know. Are you feeding your chicken? Oh, he's spoiling your chicken. Oh, I always do. <laughs> I usually hand feed her corn at night. Oh, okay. She'll get the corn too. Yeah. <laughs> Good to see you. All right. I try to bring my neighbor on. He's too shy. So he's right, I believe. This is probably a turkey feather. 
a, a baby turkey feather because it does have that energy, that look of a mature, the larger turkey feathers. I have a couple inside. <sighs> so yeah, so my TV show is going to be launching on the network this week. Uh, then it'll be on different times of the day just to see. Oh, there's a horse. If you could see that horse over there. He hides. There he is. You can see his head a little bit. Look at that picture. How do I make that brighter? There you go. Connection available. I don't know what that means. So the TV show Talking With Our Angels will be on the air within the next few days, I believe. And we'll, they'll be airing it on the She TV Network, S-H-E TV. And the easiest way to get there is with a TV to go app. And you can get it on Android and iPhone, TV, T-O-G-O, -O, TV to go. And just search for She TV. And each day I think it's gonna be on at a different time. So it might be nine in the morning, 12 in the afternoon, five in the evening, I don't know. We'll find out, I'll, I'll know at least one or two times and then they'll just play around every day and try a different time. So you, at least you'll know a time to get it. There will be some streaming available on some networks. If you have smart TV, it'll be available there. If you have, if you connect with Roku or Amazon Fire, Viacom, Comcast, and certain states, certain cities, LA, oh, Alabama, somewhere in Alabama, Tyler, Texas, you'll have it in your rabbit ears, meaning your, your local TV, whatever you get locally. I hear some noise. I think there's a deer over there. Unless it's the turkeys. Those are generally the two loud sounds that I hear out here. That loud. Looking down there at the pond. Big old pond. Catherine, joy, joy, joy. Thanks for tuning in. Walking in paradise. Thanks for walking in paradise with us. We got a gift from the angels today. Angel feather. Actually, it's a turkey feather. But there's a saying, a belief that when you find a feather, your angels are acknowledging. Whatever you're thinking about is blessed or you're blessed or loved ones are sending you messages from above from heaven or fairies basically it's a good omen <laughs> this is upstate new york where are you from catherine what state what country you can type it in share this facebook walk with everybody all of your friends if they want to walk in paradise with us rustling it's pretty light rustling I would guess it'd be turkeys usually the deer you hear the cracking of the small branches on the ground Look at this, this is, this is it, Brian. 
Doesn't this just open your heart wide open? What a view. What a view. That's a hawk, baby. I don't know if you saw it, but you could hear it. There's a hawk blessing us out there. That's the first time I've captured a hawk on, on the screen. Usually they don't like me doing that. So I respect them. Their privacy, but they actually flew right into the picture here. Let's see here. How do I get... There we go, back to screen, back to main screen. That was a great blessing. Two bird feathers and then a hawk, which is one of my totems, flew into the picture and then talked with us two, three times, screeched. What a true blessing. Look at that, look at that beautiful picture. Just video is moving photographs. Look at that, look at that fence line, the wooden fence over here, there's a picture. The rays of the sun coming through. I'm just, my heart is just eating up all this <sighs> prana, energy, life force. Well, that's about the end of the big old views. I kind of don't want to go any further because of this. And actually, if I go home, I can go tar my roof twice a year, spring and uh, summer. Or maybe it's, it's only twice a year. Why am I doing it summertime? I think we've had so much rain, I want to put tar around the, the vents because it sometimes can leak in the very, very rough storms. I'm just feeling to go back. It's only a half a mile walk instead of a whole mile. But I'll be working up on the roof. Not that that's a lot of walking or anything. But I'll be hauling the ladder and climbing up and maybe I'll do a, another edition of Facebook Live from the top of my house. That'd be interesting. Well, we're headed home. I think I'll end this uh, Facebook Live just for let everybody get back to something a little more fresh. You've already walked down the road. Of course, walking up the road is a whole other beautiful thing. And we get to see the painted colors of light of the sun as it starts to come to sunset. Look at that. That orange from the sun. a lot more shade, the air is cooling down. So yeah, if you go to talkingwitharangels.com, you could start to see the guests who are coming up. I have most of the guest pictures and names. And I'll start putting up the links to She TV on TV to go app. So you can get that. I have a new show that I'm actually doing. It's called The Angel Feathers. All right, I have a low battery warning here. So I'm going to say goodbye till later. Joy, joy, joy. Thanks for walking in paradise with us.